Hey everyone, welcome back for another logic lesson. Uh, today we're going to practice what we've learned so far in our first eight lessons, and we'll get started with our cards. Remember, for the first couple cards, I'm going to ask you the questions, and then for the last few, I will just remind you of them, because those will be the ones that we practice with the most. Our first two are our newest two, so let's get going. Remember, use your actual strong voice to answer my questions for the first two cards. Check out this, okay? Think about your answers. Think about what you know. And what is this? That's right. This is one of our letters. What is this letter's name? Good. This is D. This is our letter D. What sound do you make when you see the letter D? Good. You should be saying D, D. Okay, put your hand on your throat and say D. Do you feel it? Yes, you should. So this is voiced or unvoiced? Good. If you feel it in your throat, in your voice box, then it is a voiced sound. And is D a consonant sound or a vowel sound? Good. D is a consonant sound. So this is our newest one. It's a letter. Name is D. Sound is D. Consonant sound, and it's voiced. Before we learned all about D, we learned all about this. What is this? Good. It is a letter. What's its name? Yep, this letter's name is S. What sound do you make when you see S? Great. You say S. Put your hand on your throat. Say S. Do you feel it? No. So is it voiced or unvoiced? You're right. This is an unvoiced sound. And is S a consonant sound or a vowel sound? Yep. Consonant sound. Okay, let's move on. Now, just listen as I tell you about this card and refresh your memory. This is a letter. Its name is O. Its sound is AW. We know that this is a vowel sound, and AW is the short vowel sound for O. Check this out. This is a letter. Its name is N. The sound you make when you see N is N. N is a consonant sound, and it is voiced, and it is also nasal because it goes through our nose. And finally, this is a letter. Its name is T. The sound we make when we see T is T, and that is an unvoiced consonant sound. We do not use our voice when we say t. All right, uh, let's do this. Get your whiteboard marker and eraser ready, and we're going to do sound drill. Remember, during sound drill, we want to go fast. I'm going to make a sound. You're going to write the letter. You can just write one lowercase letter in the middle of your board for each sound. Let's get started. Okay, let's get started. I'm going to say, show me the letter that makes the sound D. D. Hopefully you have the letter D. Very good. D. D is our newest letter. It's a consonant. It says D. Okay, erase, erase, erase. Show me the letter that says S. S. Okay, I hope you have the letter S for S. Erase, erase. Next. Ooh, this is a good one. Show me the letter that makes the short vowel sound, aw. 
Let's check it. It is the letter O. Good. Erase. Show me the letter that makes the sound N. N. Okay, I hope you have the letter N, because N is our letter that makes the sound N. And last but not least, show me the letter that makes the sound T. T. And I hope you have the letter T. Good. T is our letter that makes that unvoiced consonant sound T. Okay, you can erase and put your board to the side because it's time for us to read some words. Um, yeah, I'm excited. We're going to read some words together and see how you do. We're going to read five words. So have that thumb ready to fingerspell. The first three words are going to um, have that consonant sound D at the beginning. Actually, they might not all be at the beginning, but they're going to be somewhere in the word. So look out for the letter D and that sound D. I'm going to do this one with you to get you started. So put your thumb up and let's fingerspell. Ready, set, go. D, A, T, dot. That's the word dot. Can you try it all by yourself? Ready, set, go. Yep, we've got the consonant D for D. O is saying ah, T is saying T. Perfect, dot. Oh, wow, look at this word. We see two Ds in this word. Let's see if we can get it together. Ready? One, two, three, go. D, add, dad. This is the word dad. D-A-D -D spells dad. The word dad has the D sound at the beginning and at the end. Ooh, in this word we see our two newest letters with a vowel in between. Let's see if you can get this one all by yourself and then we'll check it together. Ready? One, two, three, go. All right, let's see if you got it. I'm going to fingerspell and read sad, sad. Did you get the word sad? We have S saying S, A saying A, and D saying D, sad. Okay, we've got two more words to do. So check out this one. Try it on your own. Ready, set. Go. All right, I'm going to check it with you. We have sap, sap. Did you finger spell sap? S is saying S. A says A, P says P, sap. Okay, this is your last one. See if you can get it. Thumb up. Ready, set. Go. See how you did. I'm going to read n odd nod. N odd nod. My N is saying n. O is saying ah. D is saying d nod. Okay, super job reading. Let's move on to some spelling words. This is our last job for logic today. So have your whiteboard ready, have your marker ready, and your eraser ready. We're going to do three practice words. All three of these words are going to have our newest letter D somewhere in them. They could be at the beginning or the end. So what you're going to do is you're going to echo and say each word back to me 
you're going to fingerspell it and write it on your board. Let's get started. Remember, if you make a mistake, that's okay, because I'm always going to check every word with you and give you a chance to fix your mistakes. Please just try your best. Your first word is the word pad. Pad. So say pad, fingerspell it, and write it. And we'll check in a second. All right, let's see how you did. When I fingerspell and say pad, I hear the sounds p -ad pad. So on my board, I need to write P for P, A for A, and D for D, pad. If you don't have P, A, D, please fix your mistake before we move on. All right, word number two is the word dot. So say dot, fingerspell it, and write it. Okay, let's see how we go, or how we did. When I echo dot and fingerspell, I hear d -ot dot. Okay, so check your letters. When I write this on my board, I would need to put D for D, O for A, T for T, dot. All right, KB, we only have one more word. You can do it. Stay with me. Your last word is the word sad. Sad. Okay, so echo sad, finger spell it, and write it. Okay, let's see how you did. Let's finger spell sad, sad. So on your board, you should have S for S, A for A, D for D, sad. If you made a mistake, please fix it. All right, this is the end of our lesson. We did a really good job practicing with our newest letter, D, which makes the consonant sound D. And I can't wait to keep practicing with you at school. You're all doing such a great job.